Hello viewers, welcome to today's tutorials. I'm going to take you through the volume of a cord of a thruster. That is a thruster of a cord, a cord thruster. So uh, how do we find the volume? We know a method that is longer. I'm not going to go to show you the method that you already know. I'm going to show you a method that gives you the answer direct without going through the long method, without involving similarity and enlargement. The method I'm going to show you is that uh, if, we have, if we have a cord, like it is here, a first of a cord, uh, like it is here. If we have here, uh, this, is, uh, this is your H, and this is your R, and this is your R, the volume equals to the volume equals to a third pi h into brackets a third pi h into brackets r squared plus r h uh, plus that is plus r r plus r squared plus r squared so that is the formula if we use this formula we get the volume direct you can use the other method and see if you get the same answer that is a third pi h into brackets r squared plus r r that's more r and r capital plus r capital squared which will give you the volume for instance in this equation we are given the radius of the smaller to be 3.5 and the radius of the larger to be 4.2 and the height is 8 so therefore volume equals to a third times 22 over 7 times the height in this case is 8. Then brackets r squared, that is 3.5 squared, then plus this is r, that is 3.5 times 4.2 plus r squared, which is 4.2 squared. This gives you the area, the volume. So our volume will be equal to, you just multiply that, you get 8.3. 8 then 3.5 squared you get 12.25 plus this when you multiply the 2 you get 14.7 plus 4.2 squared you get 7 18.64. You add all this, our volume becomes 8.3809 times. You add all of this, you divide them to be 44.59. 44.59. So when you multiply this, our V, our volume becomes 373.7 centimeters cubed. Centimeters cubed. That is the shortest. We can uh, see the other method. We involve similarity and enlargement and see. That is, we take it to method two. In that case, we were supposed to two, make it a cord with a 3.5 here, with a 4.2 here, and here we are told is 8 centimeters. And therefore, that means if uh, I prolong here, I call it H, we can easily find the, the H, that is the height of uh, the larger cord. So that means if we use similar time enlargement, 8 plus H all over H will give you 4.2 all over 3.5. So we cross multiply, we find that uh, 4.2 H equals to 3.5, we are using my calculator here. It will be 3.5 times 8. It is 28 plus 3.5 h. Like times together, we bring it here 4.2 minus 3.5. If you bring it the other side, 4.2 minus 3.5, you get 0 0.7. 0.7 h equals to uh, equals to. Uh, now here we have. Uh, Yes, we have equals to 28. You divide by 0 0.7, divide by 0 0.7, so that edge equals to 40. You get your edge to be 40. So if your edge is 40, 
So that means here is 40, so the whole, the height, the larger height becomes 40 plus 8, which is equal to 48. And we know volume of uh, a cord, volume of a cord is a third. Now the first one, the volume of the first one will be volume of first one will be equal to a third, a third pi r squared h minus a third pi r squared h. This gives you a third times 22 over 7 times r squared is 4.2 squared times the height which is 48. Whatever we get we minus a third times 22 over 7 times r squared which is 3.5 squared times our height which is now 40. So this gives you just use your calculator, you say it's a third, a third times 22 all over 7 times 4.2 squared, then times 48. This gives you 807.04, then minus, we get the other one, is a third times 22 all over 7 times 3.5 squared then times 40 it gives you 513.33 if we subtract the 2 we will get that is 807.04 minus 513.33 you will get the answer to be 373, 373.71, 71 centimeters cubed. So you realize you get the same answer, but this one is longer because you have to use numerical enlargement so that you find the height and the other height, and then from there you apply the formula. So it's better to get that a simple method of getting the answer directly. Thank you for listening and uh, subscribe for more updates. Thank you.